Hello my crafty friends, it's Crystal with Happy to Plan. So I'm going to be doing a Tuesday morning haul for you today. And I did take most of the stuff out of the packaging already because I wanted to, there's a lot of pieces to each thing. So I wanted to take it out of the packaging so I wouldn't have the crinkling on the video and I wouldn't have to edit all that out. So um, just know most of the stuff came out of the packaging already, but um, I will show you what the packaging is and um, that way if you want to get the numbers off the video you can. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is this Bow Bunny Cottontail Collection and I'm going to share this with you first. So I went ahead, I did pick up the washi tape that came with the collection. It's really super cute. Um, let me open this up. So this one has um, bunnies and uh, flowers on it. And these are bunnies that are in the die cuts. This one is just a design that looks like one of the papers, which I'll show you in a second. This one is really cute. It's got like little tiny tasks, text that looks like advertisements for like um, flowers and um, sweet peas and different things. So um, yeah, really cute. I really like this one. I think I'll use this one a lot in my junk journaling. This one, again, kind of a, a design that pulled from the paper. And then just a gold washi sparkle. And then another design that's pulled from the paper, this kind of like striped polka dot design. A floral. And then this one is the eggs. So there's eight washi tapes in all. And I like that they're all different sizes. Um, and then I got the layered chipboard set. I love this one with the picket fence, the happy Easter, and my happy place, and the little eggs. And then the die cuts are, I actually have already purchased this die cut set before. Um, so I'm not going to open this up, but you can kind of see what's in here. There's a couple like little eggs and the picket fence and the, um, the bunnies cute little tags. So there's 28 pieces in here. Really, really super cute. And then um, here is the paper. So I'll go ahead and flip through the paper. And basically what it is, I'm just going to flip through one of them because it um, repeats itself. So this is the first section. I love the cut aparts with the florals. I think that's really cute. Um, Love the word one. Here's the one that looks like the swashy tape. That one has the same effect as that washi tape. Oh, and then this one is the one that this washi tape looks like. So I do like that they have the washi tape match the paper. I think that's cool. And then the blue, and then this one's really pretty with the kind of watercolor, the watermark of the flowers. Love that one. Love, love this one. That looks like the washi tape, the really thin washi tape. The little bunny on the side here is really cute. And then the bunny on this side. Really pretty floral. Love this one. With the, I love these up here. Sorry about the shadows. That one's super cute too. Really, really cute paper. Very cute collection. Okay, and then the other collection that I picked up was this um, Echo Park paper um, spring market. And this was a collection that Cheaply Chic used for one of her journals. It was the Grow the Grow Girl collection. And the reason I know that is because I remember this particular spread that I had that I used this paper in. So it has like all the little wreaths in it. Yeah. So I love this paper. I, it's interesting to me because it's one I, oftentimes you don't see black with like a spring line with a spring line and I really like the black accents. I think that's cool. So here is the cut apart pages. They are double sided. So 
So there's that side, those two sides. And then there's this one, and then this one. Yeah, and then the sticker sheet, of course, is really, really sweet. I love this one with the like the little tape, but the stapler. I don't know why. That's I, just, I just love that sticker for some reason. And then the joy, it's really cute. I love the truck at the top. Really cute. I'm very excited that I found this pic this paper. All right, so I didn't realize when I was going through all this stuff that I had pulled a bunch of things that were like pocket things. <laughs> so I'm going to go through each of these. Um, so this one is the here and there, and it's the crepe paper. And again, I took it out of the envelope or out of the plastic just to, um, you know, make sure that I wasn't crinkling on this film. So there is the... Uh, skew and so basically this is just a bunch of pockets I've got this one that says travel moments big huge window here ticket and receipts with the little window love the little Vespa at the bottom bottom there and then explore and then memory gathered adventure and this is just like a library pocket and then a black one I love that with the little scene on it little city and then the little pink little envelope so those all were in that one and then I had another one the Maggie Holmes Willow Lane and that's right here wow it's five dollars I didn't realize it was five dollars but that's okay because this is really super cute to me and then it says love you and there's a little and all, all of these pockets have little tags with it so this one has like a little tag. It looks like a little picket fence. Really cute. That one has a little heart in there. And then this one is an envelope and this little cherish this day. I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's printed on the envelope. And then look how cute this little thing is. It's like a little like notebook sewed to this paper. And I could totally make these. That's a really cute idea. And then this one's a, a die cut a floral. I love this one with the hearts. Cutouts and the vellum glued on there or sewed on there. Really cute. And then this one has XOXO and inside it's got like crate like a uh, confetti in there. Cut up confetti. And then there is a little piece of paper in there as well. So those are all really cute. And then this one is a Jolie floral journal card. So it's got this on one side, it says happy, and then it's sewed around the edges. And it's kind of a little bit of a shaker. Cherish every moment, gather happy memories. And it's got a little card that comes out. And then on the back it says create joy. And then this one says, find your beauty in every day. And then it's a journaling card on the back. I don't know how feasible that really is, but I really think this is really cool. I really like all three of these. And then I got another, I got a Bow Bunny pocket cards. I don't think this particular one is for a specific line. It doesn't say on here. Oh no, it says Harmony. Okay, okay. I was looking for the name and I couldn't find it. So it's for the Harmony collection. And I'm fairly certain I have the die cuts for this. Um, so that's this one with the little pocket. These are all like little library pockets. Really cute. This one actually has a library card in it. No pocket. I like this one with the florals. So like I said, I think I'm pretty sure I have the die cuts for these. So. Um, and I'm fairly certain I've seen the paper, but I didn't see it at the one that I bought the stuff at. So I might, I might pick up the paper for that if I see it next time. Okay. And then this one is another Jolie one for 2 dollars 
and there is this little adventure one. My son is going on a trip, so I'm doing a journal for him, and um, I just thought these would be really unique to put in there. Pretty sure, I want to say this is a sticker, but I don't, it's not pulling off, so maybe it's not a sticker. And then this one's got a really cool envelope with um, this little hot air balloon. That was your trip. And then I love this envelope, but this is so cool. It's like got one of those little closures at the front. And then it's like burlap. I think this is really cool. I hope I can figure out a really cool way to use this. And then just one more final thing. I picked up two more of these little uh, photo crate boxes. Um, I did want to put my, I recently did a thing where I put my die cuts in these. Um, and I'll link that video up at the top if you're interested. But I put my die cuts in these and I needed some more for my chipboard sticker, my chipboard and my wood veneers. So I thought I went ahead, I went ahead and picked up two more. They're a little expensive, but I think they're just the right thing for what I needed it for. So that is what I purchased at Tuesday morning and I hope that you guys enjoyed. I will see you again real soon. Bye for now.